Today on our 2018 Ford Explorer, we're going to be taking a look at and showing you how to install the PTC Custom Fit Cabin Air Filter. All right, as you can see, we have the original cabin air filter right here and the new one right here. Now, this comes out of a 2018, so it's a fairly new car with not a whole lot of miles. And right away, you can see the difference in color. This filter is going to help improve your cabin's air quality by catching any particulates from the outside. It's just going to create an overall more healthy environment, and it's also going to help it smell better, too. It's also going to help your vehicle's HVAC system by flowing more freely, which in turn is going to help with the efficiency. Now it's recommended that you change your cabin air filter every 12 to 18,000 miles or once a year. Speaking of which, we'll go ahead and show you how to do that now. Now we will be working behind our glove box, so it's a good idea to get any contents you might have inside removed. Once you have that done, you can go ahead and open it. We're going to remove this panel here. Now you can use a trim panel tool or a flathead. However, I just like to use my hands. Simply just pry outward. There's a couple clips that'll pop free, like this. All right, our next step is going to be remove this string and clip from the glove box. Now how we're going to do that, you can use a flathead or if you can get your hands back in there to do it, that'll do the trick. We're actually going to pry it this way. It'll just pop out like that. Now at the bottom of the glove box, it's going to rest on a rod that goes from side to side. That's going to allow the glove box to pivot. Now what's keeping the glove box attached to that rod is two clips like this. These are actually going to clip in this way towards the bottom. You're going to have to close the glove box and get underneath the dash. And with the flathead, you can take the tip of the screwdriver and pull this way towards the inside of the vehicle and they'll, they'll pop free. All right, now we can go ahead and remove our glove box. There's gonna be two tabs up on top. We're just gonna have to push those up and apply pressure downward on the glove box. We'll let it come down and pull it out of the way. So here's the two tabs that we pushed on to release the glove box. Some models may have knee airbags that may interfere with you removing the glove box. You'll know that if you see it labeled airbag or if you see any wires or electrical connectors that are yellow. If you see that, you should go to your local dealer and have them do perform the service. All right, our cabin filter is behind this cover here. To remove it, there's a tab on each side. We'll put our fingers behind and pull towards us. That's what the tabs look like. All right, as you can see, now we have access to our cabin air filter. So we can pull it out. You can use your fingers or anything you can get to get a grab on it and pull it out towards you. It's always a good idea too to make a note of the airflow direction before we pull it out so we can install the new one the same way. So now we'll go ahead and take our new filter and as I mentioned earlier pay attention to the airflow. We want to make sure we put it back in the right position. And it's as easy as just putting it back into the slot. I'm going to push it in all the way. All right, now we can take our cap and push it back into place. All right, now we can go ahead and put everything back in the same way that we took it out. Line the glove box up. Push it up into place. And now the tabs We'll hold it while we get everything else back together. Now with that in place, that will complete our install.
And that'll do it for our look at and installation of the PTC custom fit cabin air filter on our 2018 Ford Explorer.